everyone. If you guys can't hear me, um, it's not. It's because I can't. I don't have my mic connected. And one, one second. Okay, there. Yeah, that's better. So, um, so this is my first ever makeup video. If you go to my recent videos, you can see that I did a purple lip shade, and I'm gonna be showing a tutorial on how to be doing it. All right. So you're gonna need foundation any type that is lighter than your lip color and you need a facial powder uh, the skin color powder I don't know what they call it but it's like a powder with your skin color and you need a dark lip shade like this okay and these are the three things that you're gonna be needing but the main thing is you need kajal kajal this eyebrow pencil no sorry um you keep it on like on your eyelids or something I, i'm not sure but i use it a lot so i'm just gonna carry on one second and only if i had a table i don't have a table wait let me just pull that chair closer you can fast forward all this technical difficulties sorry Okay. Okay. First, take facial powder. I'm going to be taking a little bit. You might already know what brand this is. I'm going to be taking a little bit. Don't ask me why there's a hole in there. Okay, you're going to... I don't have a mirror here, so it's hard for me. Okay, you layered it, all right? I mean, I layered it. So now you're gonna be needing foundation. Okay, yeah. You're gonna be needing foundation and you're gonna keep a little bit, all right? I have a sponge here. If you don't, um, keep it on your finger or anywhere else and apply it. I took this much. It's a bit too little, right? Wait, let me just take a bit more. Okay, that's enough. Alright. No. Okay, technical difficulties again, but it's okay. Okay. You guys might be thinking I'm just a kid playing with my mom's makeup. I mean, this is my mom's makeup, but I am kind of trying here so you're gonna blend it all in you can see it's a catastrophe right now but I promise it will be better it's gonna turn out really good all right not really good I mean for me it's okay it's gonna turn out okay I think so let me just go get the cap I'm very sorry skip this part Alright, I'm back, I'm back, I'm back, I'm really sorry, I'm back. So, now, you're gonna layer it with a second layer of powder. Only if I could zoom in, can I? I can't. Alright. Take the same amount you took for the first time. Can you? I need to lower on the lighting, I'm really sorry, too many technical difficulties. I'm gonna take a little bit. there and now you're going to I'm just where is it okay so you take your cudgel now and you're gonna layer it inside here oh my god blend it in i know it looks really bad but after it's blended with the dark shade lips stick i mean gloss it's gonna turn out better one second like a really hard press down blend all right 
Alright, you can already see the purple starting to kick in. Line it like this. I hope I'm not going too fast. There, you can see the purple on this side, but I just need to layer it with a second layer. So don't worry that your kajal is going to get all glossy and stuff because it's not going to happen. It's not going to happen. Kajal is very dry. So oh no, I got it in my mouth. Oh, okay. Oh my God, I added a bit too much, but blend it in. And if it gets too dark, make sure to apply foundation on the outside. See? You can see that. Wait, I'm gonna... There. Blend it. No, it's like I'm kind of nervous because this is my first ever video and... Okay, you see that? Now you're gonna blend it with the outsides here, not just like the inside, it looks really bad like that, so. You're gonna. Make sure to like move your lips while you're blending in, so. Can you see that? So now you guys might be thinking there's no more kajal, I can keep this back, but no. You have to add a little tiny bit more. You can see that it's only in one part of my lips, but it has to get to like, a, like this much part of my lips. So I'm gonna try again, like outline here. There. Keep blending. Ta-da! This is the hardest part of the shade. So, like, I, I have lots of simple, or like, simple things, like normal products that basically everyone has. Not too many people, though. I have a foundation and I mean, I'm sure everyone has the shade, right? If you don't, you can use a lighter shade, or if you have a darker shade, it's way better. This is my darkest shade, so I don't have anything else. You can see that, right? You can see that one part of this side is too bright, so, and this side is way small. This side is blended in perfectly. do that and it'll actually blend in with the color but this side try that it's still like that so we're gonna add a we're gonna take our sponge that we used just now I'm gonna apply a tiny bit of foundation here and you can see it's like fully white on this side and it looks really bad. But take the same shade again and keep it on one little line. You might see it's already uh, pink over here. I usually never do that mistake, but. Okay, so now you're gonna take a bit more foundation one second why is it not coming okay you might be thinking a uh, foundation is not healthy on your skin i mean it's not but if you use very little then it's okay first you're going to blend in the foundation i'm going to do it with the sponge 
Okay. Now I'm gonna try to blend the color. Okay, this side is like dark to light. This side is a bit too light over here, so. Oh, come on. I have to perfect this. Here, a bit. Dot, little dot, okay, little dot, no more than that. Okay, blend that in. You can see it created a line, right? You're gonna take your sponge again. There, it's gone. It's still too light? Oh, it's still too light. Okay, I'm gonna try something different this time. I'm gonna keep some gloss over here. Oh my God, that just ruined it. <laughs> Okay, I'm, I'm gonna fix it. I know I can. Okay. Okay, okay, wait, let me get a tissue. Okay, I think it's good enough. It's just a bit too light here. Oh. Wait, it's fixed, it's fixed, it's fixed. Wait, let's compare, all right. Mm, pretty good, actually, it's pretty good. So, oh, I can't zoom in, okay. This is the end result, if you got the same, but you want it a bit lighter or darker on the inside take your pencil again so i'm gonna do the light first so people who want it lighter on the inside um and dark on the outside i'm gonna show you guys right now i'm trying to make this video as short as i can oh my god Okay, on the foundation. Okay. Oh my God. <laughs> okay. You can see it got lighter on the inside, so I'm gonna make the outsides dark. I'm gonna show you guys how. Outline it on one side and outline the other on the bottom. See? Okay, you can see the difference already, right? This side is darker, but this side is lighter. So you just need to add a tiny bit more. If it's too much, it's gonna be a problem. Try to blend it in with the middle, all right? And if you want, okay. Look here. Finished result, all right? Make sure none of uh, the shade is going out or else it'll look like really bad. <laughs> so this is done. And if you want the top lid, like um, better, like no, not better, um, darker, darker. So, you can see it's still lighter on the inside. And if it's too dark and when it just looks like a normal, you're gonna do the same thing, add foundation always. But you can also use powder. It's a, powder is a way better like a substitute for foundation because uh, powder is like, Okay, Lit, uh, foundation is like a type of liquidy, pasty type. 
but this is powder so it's way easier to blend but foundation is like if it makes it too light it's a problem if it's too little it's a problem too so Ta so we're done with the purple and we're done with this so we're gonna make it dark like really dark on the inside so what should we get kajal cry all right gonna layer it really nice you can already see it's happening Oh, the blackness is gone already? Oh my god. Alright, that's pretty good. But I want it to blend in. Okay. Enough with the kajal pencil. Uh, we're gonna keep it down. And if you think that the outsides are a bit too, you know, dark, then there's some foundation, powder, whatever. Do it in like a circular motion. It's going to get way easier to do it, like blend it instead of, look at that. So because of the blending of the colors, it's going to make your sponge dirty if you have one. Ta-da! Wait, I'm just going to fix it up. Oh, it got on the outside too. Make sure this, this part, just like a hard type of like thing make sure to always wipe away the excess on it or else um it'll just look like princess peach's lips and if you okay if this is the shade you want that's all but also make sure to bite down not bite down but do this It'll get chappy, but if you want it more glossy, if you have a clear gloss or anything like that, just use that, all right? But uh, try not to use dark shade glosses like this. Try to use very light shades or just clear lip gloss, all right? But don't ever do it with the brush. Always do it with your finger because if you do it with the brush, it's going to get really like dirty and it's really hard to wash brushes because uh i've been through it before and you really don't want to go through that if you want it darker inside okay i'm gonna end this uh, video at 20 minutes so we have one minute 30 seconds left hmm that makes it There. Okay. Is that good? All right. Well, guys, I'll see you next time in the next video. Bye bye. Peace out. Love ya. Okay. 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 I'll just.